y'all, Crystal and Mrs. HappyHomemaker.com here. And today we're we'll making a dill pickle pot roast, a dill pickle in a ranch pot roast in the crock pot. Seven ingredients, super easy, super delicious. And did I mention dill pickle in a ranch? <laughs> Let's make this. So first I'm gonna add a four pound roast to my slow cooker. You can use a beef chuck roast, a sirloin tip roast. I usually use a beef chuck roast for it, but the sirloin tip roast was way cheaper than the chuck roast this week, so that's what I went with. They will both work beautifully. So I have a 24 ounce jar of baby dill pickles. I am going to pour off a half a cup into my measuring cup here, and then I'm gonna take the rest of this juice and pour it into a different cup and set it aside for a later use. Or you could discard it too, but I like to use pickle juice for other marinating needs. Now I have one packet of dry ranch seasoning mix. This is one ounce and I'm just gonna sprinkle that over my roast. Now I have a brown gravy packet. This is 0.87 ounces. I'm gonna open that up and I'm gonna sprinkle that over my roast too. Now I've got my 24 ounce jar of pickles. I have it drained and I have reserved a half a cup of the juice here and I'm putting my drained pickles. I'm gonna try to put my drained pickles, there we go. Now they went <laughs> and arrange them around my dill, or around my roast. Now I'm gonna add six cloves of garlic, whole. And I'm gonna add a half a cup of pickle juice. I'm gonna pour that all over the roast. It's gonna help break down those spice mixes. And then I'm gonna take a little bit of dill weed, about a half a teaspoon worth, and I'm gonna sprinkle that over the whole thing. I'm gonna put my lid on this crock pot. I am gonna let this cook on low for about nine to 10 hours. If you're making this with a chuck roast, this will likely take about nine to 10 hours on low. If you're cooking this with a sirloin tip roast, you will likely need about 12 hours on low in your crock pot instead as sirloin tips don't have as much fat content as a chuck roast, so it takes it a little bit longer to break down. The dill pickles break down beautifully too and are oh so tender. Pile this high on a bun with some cheese like provolone and oh my goodness, some good eating. If you like this recipe, then check out my blog, mrshappyhomemaker.com. Come.